Hey there and welcome. So today I'm going to show you how you can add some of our public calendars to your Google Calendar and also to your Outlook Calendar. Uh, the process is um, split down Outlook, there's a desktop app and a mobile app, so I'm going to show you how to do add both of those today. So I'm starting out here at the page www.salemhs.vbschools.com slash pages slash events. Some of these calendars are also available on the VB Schools website at www.vbschools.com slash calendar. So the first calendar, the, both of these pages work very similarly. Uh, I'm going to switch here from the combined calendars because you can only add a single calendar. So when I go down here to the VBCPS school year calendar, that's going to change to our school year calendar. And uh, there's a couple ways you ha add this. If you're going to add this to your Google Calendar, make sure you're logged into Google Chrome and you're signed in with the account you want to add it to. You just click the uh, plus Google Calendar here and this calendar will get added automatically to your Google Calendar. It may come up and ask for permissions. I think I've already added this calendar so it's already on here. Uh, and when I when I do that the calendar then shows up over here under my other calendars because it is a read-only calendar. To add it to the Office 365 Outlook web app, very similar. What we're going to do here in this case however is we're going to grab from right down here where it says subscribe to this link don't click on it but right click and we're going to copy the link address it might be off the bottom of your screen down there uh, but copy the link address and then uh, we're going to go here into our calendar and we're going to click on add calendar from internet and I'll paste the URL in and I'm also going to add the calendar name this is VBCPS calendar and click save it's going to take it just a minute and here it is it shows up over here on your left nav bar again under other calendars because we have read only access to that um, and there we go there's uh, the event starting to pop in and populate on that calendar uh, the other place that you can add this if you're using the um, Outlook desktop app for your calendars. You can go to your calendars and I'm going to go here to open a calendar and I'm going to open it from the internet. This one's a little simpler. You just have to paste the URL and click OK. Select Yes. After a few minutes it should upload and sync for you and then it now shows up here under other calendars again because it's a read-only calendar. In uh, the Outlook desktop app you can actually drag this calendar to a different calendar if you prefer and it'll show up there and you can always click the uh, overlay arrow here to overlay that calendar over whichever calendar you're looking at. So that's three ways to add calendars to your Google Calendar, to your Office 365 calendar, and also to your Outlook desktop calendar. Uh, the Google Calendar and the Office 365 calendars, by the way, once you add the calendars there, they are also available when you configure your phone to pull in those calendars.